What's up film buffs? Today we will be analyzing the movies of Matt Damon. To date, his movies have made $9.2 billion. Starting with Mystic Pizza, released in 1988. It made $13 million. It was a hit. Rising Sun, released in 1990. At the time of this video's production, the revenue data was absent. School Ties, released in 1992. It made $15 million. It was a flop. Geronimo, an American legend. Released in 1993. It made $19 million. It was a flop. The Good Old Boys. Released in 1995. The earning figures were not accessible at the time of filming. Courage Under Fire. Released in 1996. It made $101 million. It was a hit. Goodwill Hunting. Released in 1997. It made $226 million. It was a winner. The Rainmaker. Released in 1997. It made $46 million. It broke even. Chasing Amy. Released in 1997. It made $12 million. It was a money maker. Saving Private Ryan. Released in 1998. It made $482 million. It was a hit. Rounders. Released in 1998. It made $23 million. It was a success. The Talented Mr. Ripley. Released in 1999. It made $129 million. It was a blockbuster. Dogma. Released in 1999. It made $31 million. It was a winner. The Legend of Bagger Vance. Released in 2000. It made $39 million. It didn't make a profit. All the Pretty Horses. Released in 2000. Financial details were undisclosed during the making of this video. Titan A. Released in 2000. It made $37 million. It was a bust. Finding Forrester. Released in 2000. It made $80 million. It was a success. Ocean's Eleven. Released in 2001. It made $451 million. It was a blockbuster. Jerry. Released in 2002. It made $255,000. It was a failure. Spirit Stallion of the Cimarron. Released in 2002. It made $123 million. It was a success. The Born Identity. Released in 2002. It made $214 million. It was a winner. Stuck on You. Released in 2003. It made $66 million. It was a success. Ocean's 12. Released in 2004. It made $363 million. It was a money maker. The Born Supremacy. Released in 2004. It made $289 million. It was a big hit. Jersey Girl. Released in 2004. It made $35 million. It broke even. Seriana. Released in 2005. It made $94 million. It was a success. The Brothers Grimm. Released in 2005. It made $105 million. It was a success. The Good Shepherd. Released in 2006. 
It made $100 million. It was a success. The Departed. Released in 2006. It made $291 million. It was a big hit. Ocean's 13. Released in 2007. It made $311 million. It was a hit. The Bourne Ultimatum. Released in 2007. It made $443 million. It was a big hit. Youth Without Youth. Released in 2007. It made $244,000. It was a failure. The Informant. Released in 2009. It made $42 million. It was a success. Invictus. Released in 2009. It made $122 million. It was a big hit. Green Zone. Released in 2010. It made $95 million. It broke even. True Grit. Released in 2010. It made $252 million. It was a hit. Hereafter. Released in 2010. It made $107 million. It was a blockbuster. The Adjustment Bureau. Released in 2011. It made $128 million. It was a winner. Margaret. Released in 2011. It made $46,000. It was a flop. Happy Feet 2. Released in 2011. It made $150 million. It was a success. Contagion. Released in 2011. It made $138 million. It was a big hit. We Bought a Zoo. Released in 2011. It made $120 million. It was a big hit. Promised Land. Released in 2012. It made $8 million. It didn't make a profit. Elysium. Released in 2013. It made $286 million. It was a big hit. The Zero Theorem. Released in 2013. It made $771,000. It was a dud. Behind the Candelabra. Released in 2013. It made $16 million. It didn't make a profit. The Monuments Men. Released in 2014. It made $155 million. It was a blockbuster. Interstellar. Released in 2014. It made $702 million. It was a moneymaker. The Martian. Released in 2015. It made $631 million. It was a hit. Jason Bourne. Released in 2016. It made $415 million. It was a winner. The Great Wall. Released in 2016. It made $332 million. It was a big hit. Downsizing. Released in 2017. It made $55 million. It was a dud. Suburb Icon. Released in 2017. It made $13 million. It didn't make its money back. Ford v Ferrari. Released in 2019. It made $226 million. It was a big hit. Stillwater. Released in 2021. It made $20 million. It broke even. The Last Duel. Released in 2021. It made $30 million. It didn't make a profit. 
Air, released in 2023. It made $90 million. It broke even. Oppenheimer, released in 2023. It made $952 million. It was a moneymaker. Drive Away Dolls, released in 2024. It made $5 million. It was a bust. He has two upcoming movies we're excited for. If, releasing May 2024. The Instigators, releasing August 2024. Thanks for watching our video on Matt Damon. What's your favorite Matt Damon movie? Who would you like to see in our next video? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe.